Well, good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. The stands here, the Corva, as the locals call them, make for quite an impressive sight, all in support of the grand old lady of the Italian game. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. Away. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Alexandro. Especially on the overlap down that left hand side. He can swing in a, a tasty cross from the byline or cut in himself and take a shot. Best of all, he's so incredibly fit that he can keep doing it for 90 minutes, by which time the opposition start to flag and he's still going strong. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Gets the better of his man. That's gone a long way up and away. <laughs> Juventus in it back again. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Shoots! Berateski. Nicely controlled. Turns and goes back. Defending of the desperate variety. Christian. Chance! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Oh, smart save. That is terrific skill. Goes for goal. Big relief, it just needed better contact. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Chalhanolu, neither side yet able to find the net. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be outmuscled. muscled 
Arthur does well there, alert. He gets past his man. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Bernardeschi. Oh, the ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. Kessier. Rebic. Right through the mid. Rebic! Good run, lovely take, but that is where it stopped. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Bentancur. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo has got himself a free kick. Just a whisker away. Quadrado. Bentancur tries to get it forward quickly. Forward it goes. Chalhanolu, he spotted the run and played him through. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Donnarumma sends that a long way. Chalhanolu. Just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Chiesa, Bernadeschi! And for a moment, time stood still. A chance that's created through very good grafting. Did well to get in the face of his opponent. Bentancur, Chiesa. Dybala. Oh, too much on it. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Arthur plays it short. Bernadeschi. And the 
shot! Goal! Well, let me assure you that scoring just before half-time is always a real treat. And when it's one of your top talents who delivers it, it just seems to fuel confidence that little bit more. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Rebic. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Kessier. The referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It was very, very tight. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Juventus merit their advantage on, on the balance of play. They did most of the probing and got their reward, although they should have a bigger lead. Could come back to haunt them. Juventus head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. Well, the action has already resumed here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Place it into the box. It's a brilliant interception. In one massive leap! to get the direction he needed. He simply mistimed the header, and it was as if he knew it wasn't going to work out. Benadeski. Bernadeschi is fouled. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Oh, Peter, what a lucky, lucky boy. A telling off as opposed to a sending off. Bernadeschi. Hoists it forward. Chalanolu looks to dink one in. Bernadeschi goes looking. Dybala. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Plays it through. Arthur was not to be moved. Bentancur. Juventus just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. And it's Dybala. Has a pop! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Well, it's a crossing feast here, but I'd advise them to keep a variety in their play to avoid being found out and stopped. Yeah, nobody's going to argue with that. De Ligt. Bentancur. 
Your impressions so far, Jim? Well, while the temptation... It's one! Wanted to outwit the keeper, but a shade off target. Artur really would relish another crack at that same challenge, I suspect. Alexandro gets into the right position to intercept. Arthur. Chiesa. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Keeper sends it forward. Hernandez. Rebic. Chiesa with a good steal, well played. Chiellini, Chiellini has given away a free kick. When it needed something decisive, he showed too many mixed signals. And it's Chalhanolu. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Milan are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. It's a loose ball. He's looking to get there first. Oh, real danger here. Now the cross. Cleared without complication. Cristiano Ronaldo. That's pretty clear, it is a foul. And no surprise, that's a booking. Juventus presented with the perfect chance here to open up their lead. This certainly looks appetizing, well within shooting range. Cristiano Ronaldo! Denied by a great piece of goalkeeping. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Juventus just have to run down the clock. Has a pop! Sticks it away! And surely that clinches it! There really is no way back now! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Juventus could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Well, some fans are already on their way out, so that to me says everything, Peter. And he has been fouled there. Chiellini. Bentancur. The time added on will be two minutes. Floats one over. Oh. 
And that could be trouble. And time is up. So they have their win. They had all the answers to whatever the opposition threw at them. And the results followed inevitably. Your final thoughts, Jim? Juventus won thanks to a, a disciplined game plan. Homework provided the groundwork and it exploited an obvious central weakness. Well, thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.